Don't forget to subscribe. We begin with Gundam. Oh, there are a million Gundam games, and like the good neighbors we are, we review them all for you in the hopes that someday we can borrow your lawnmower. There are a bunch of Gundam universes, but the one thing they all have in common are big robots beating each other up. And guess what? That's exactly what you'll get in our review of Mobile Suit Gundam Seed, Never Ending Tomorrow. Never Ending, huh? Yep, that's how I feel about this series. M is for the missiles that rocket into space, that send their nuclear payload right into my face. O is for the oil that sticks up in my hair. Just watch out for naked girls flying everywhere. B is for the battles of skill and of luck. I don't care who wins, because I can't give up. Hey, how long is this title? Mobile Suit Gundam Seed, um, oh, let's just get right to the review. If you're the kind of guy who's jonesing for Gundam action, then we have the solution. Take two every hour. If that doesn't work, try your twitchy fingers on Mobile Suit Gundam Seed, never ending tomorrow for the PS2. A game that gives you more minor characters than ever before. Yes, minor characters. I think we know how this is gonna go, but let's continue our little charade. You can play as Kira. He, I think he's a he. He's maybe a she. It is forced to fight a small fleet of Gundams, all with her own angsty teenagers. And just when you think it's over... Is it over? No! Another round of screaming teens in tight armor lines you up in their sights. Regular gameplay wouldn't be bad if it weren't for your fickle camera, which can lose a lock-on faster than Paris Hilton loses her top. If you're one of the few to manage a lock-on, the camera constantly searches for the best angle, when the only angle you need is the one that stands still. When the laser light show gets to be too much, call on a partner for a little encouragement. I know you need help, but I'm in a pretty tight spot here myself. Partners will aid your great white Gundam by healing them. Don't give up. You can keep fighting. Or by pulling out the big guns. After a rousing battle, Kira likes to go shopping for hats and pendants and makeup. Because what Gundam wouldn't be complete without a hat or makeup or... Can you hold on a sec? C throws a little fan service to players by sandwiching battles between two meaty slices of cutscenes. Of course, the meat is more like bologna with bits of this, bits of that, and a horse hoof thrown into the mix. You won't follow the story unless you already know the story. Is it so hard to put together angst, something exploding, and tack on a moral like chlamydia? Tell her it was the toilet seat. Mission mode lets you play as all those minor characters in single mission battles, which play exactly like every other battle with a cool paint job. I think it's okay. I really hope so. Just keep telling yourself that, sweetie. Mobile Suit Gundam C Never Ending Tomorrow brings together enough minor characters and teen angst to satisfy anyone from the Earth Alliance. Everyone else should just hit the eject button. They led us to the inevitable end! Jim! That's why we give it two ambiguous boys out of five. So what if it gives another androgynous boy a bird as a gift? I think masculinity is fluid and open to interpretation. He spends his day sitting in giant robots cockpit and buying makeup. Okay, a hundred to one. Either that or he's David Bowie. I suspect a mediocre review won't dissuade any Gundam fans from buying this game. But if you don't like the series to begin with, there's absolutely nothing here to change your mind.